Hello, I'm back. Back with some Life is Strange. Sure is. Save game, Chrysalis. Continue. We shall. Right, we're in the dormitories. Uh, just gonna share my to my socials. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Ow! You bumped right into us. Silly girls. Hello, Willie! doing I'm doing good I'm all right thank you just chilling out playing some life is strange one of my favorite games I don't know what is my favorite game um I mean like village re village has to be up there um I'm actually playing it again off on, on in my own time, <laughs> try to get all the achievements. Just get to your room and grab, grab Warren's flash, flash drive. Okay, we're gonna go in a minute. <laughs> I'm just going on Twitter, twi tweeting, I'm on a wave, Discord, and all the rest of it. Okay. Oh, is it gonna do it or not? Me. Right. Oh, it decides to be an asshole. But last minute. Okay. Doing great, just at home. Oh, cool. Are you just chilling out? Same as as me. I've had a long day. I've been to the. After all this action, I still have to get Warren's flash drive. Okay, I'm gonna turn it down a little bit because the volume's quite loud. Juliet, Juliet, hello, Juliet. It's the missing person again. This girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. She's popular. Where's our room then? We will bang for cheese. Oh, that's not nice. Max's room. I love her shoes. I I was so like that. When I home was at sweet home, my favorite cocoon. When I was at college, I used to dress like Max as well. I used to have those shoes. I used to be slim like her as well. Oh, the good old days. Oh, I've got a thing. Oh, mommy. Hi, mom. Happy birthday, Max. Oh no, that's, uh, this is this is the one, is it? Like, Max, your principal sent me an email saying that you told some tale. Tell a uh, what? It was not a telltale about a Blackwell honor student. Is this true? The principal says this was a serious false charge. False charge, and that he's worried you're telling stories. No. Call me ASAP so we can talk about this. No, that's not. What? We weren't telling tales. For God's sake. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Hey, girl. <laughs> I borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. 
If you need it back, just track me down in my room. Great. Right. Now I have to oh. go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Oh, she stole my freaking drive. Nice. Plant. Water. You are thirsty. Poor I'm the plant. Worst baby mama. Drink up. Baby mama. <laughs> Well, it, it will have consequences. What watering in the plant? Open sesame. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Oh. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Oh, no. Welcome oh. to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Oh, Juliet, this is so stupid. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. <gasps> How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never Look her in a room! Out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's Keep my last hostage. name? G uh... Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course oh. I didn't. Just <laughs> I didn't even I know. Uh, I was just... I don't but... care. I'll just... So, Chance how did you find that? out about them? According to Victoria, remember. Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Hmm. Huh. She saw the sex, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I said Victoria, I know the proof is in her room. We answer you, wuss. <laughs> I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. <sighs> well, what am I supposed to do then? Uh, shower. Oh. Um. Fire alarm? At least that's an alarm from this century. Using Is a she tablet. going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Nah. Jewelry. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my phone. Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Alright, okay. Come on. Let's print, 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 print. Where's the printer? What? Oh, where is it? Oh. Print. Oh shit, no. Right. Where is it gone? Oh. 
This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Ooh, Victoria was gonna go again now. Oh, shit. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dina. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zach? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. <laughs> You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Yay, Max to the rescue! Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Super Warren. Max. Super Max. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. <laughs> hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though, Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of and in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. <laughs> okay. <gasps> oh! I'm not gonna take it! That looks like a home pregnancy test. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. There's no more. But I could rewind and make it up to her. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. Hey, Dana. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? <laughs> of course. I was pregnant. Was. Oh. oh, what about the other? Deadbeat Dad? You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Sorry to pry. It's not my business. And I won't be at the game Friday. Not much school spirit, I guess. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Okay. Right, we redeemed, we 
redeemed what we did. Flash right. drive. Uh, I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. I love that Mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Aww, Warren even so left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. A goofball. Oh, Young love. Well, they're sort of crushing on each other, I think. More so him. To Max, or whom it may concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drive are a graphic life of of altering controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care and for the most discriminating viewer. I congratulate you on your taste and eagerly await your in-depth reviews of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Peace, Warren G. That's more like it. I, I like them sort of films. I love some I love weird stuff though. <laughs> no, I like like Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Aww. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Oh. Yeah, um, Cartier-Bresson, Thoinot, Hamilton, the greatest. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me in the <laughs> Space Needle. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. Weird science. Greatest TV shows ever. Go meet our mate now. Gotta go need our mate. Yeah, shit. Max reminds me so much of myself when I was in the college. The more I text, the longer I take. I'm on my way. Bye. Fuck this shit. Ow! That hurt. Damn. I better rewind. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Fuck this shit. Ow! That hurt. Um. Oh. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. 
Oh, I thought I was meant to go up to him and distract him. I forgot. I had to do that. This is, has has some pretty good damn song. Yeah, it does. And they're all like indies and, you know. It's really cool. Going to see our So mate. don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Intimidate her. Huh? You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Oh, shit. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. I could rewind and try something different. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, I guess if you took a picture though, hey, hey, it could nobody be Nobody is bullying proof, anybody. It? I'm doing my right. job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Oh, ow. David. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Oh, I should have gone with that one the first time, really. I? I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer. Whoops. <laughs> Interrupted our dialogue. I'm sorry, stepfather. <laughs> I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. I don't get it. Yeah, it's horrible. How could Zack and Victoria do that to I me? wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Oh. Max, get your ass over here. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. Ooh, Check out my he new likes wheels. her. Cool. Very old. Look, he's school. getting all. Uh, 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive. And... There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then so am I. You okay? It's been one Me strange too. fucking day. I'll go out. With I him. bet. I heard Victoria got oh, a face nice. full of pain. <laughs> I'd pay money to see a photo if of I was that. The same age as Max, I mean. Um. Really? Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in pain. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. Or a week. I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch <laughs> Cannibal Holocaust. <laughs> no fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. What? Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. <laughs> Faster, pussycat, kill, kill. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat, kill, kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? <laughs> if I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Oh. Um. I 
I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. <laughs> For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly Aww, really bizarre like, experience in Mr. Jefferson's at... class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? <gasps> You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal, now. Answer me, bitch! I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged Jeez. me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. He's like Prince Harry at the minute. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, or that whore in the bathroom! Oh! Max? Chloe? Oh, it's Chloe! No way! You again! Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! Oh my god! Fuck me! Oh, look at that! Man, Nathan head. Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day oh, never dear. ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. <laughs> After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. <laughs> Feels so weird to be back. So I Already guess Seattle's some trouble. Um, I guess it was cool, but I felt kind of lonely, out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of HipsterGirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. <laughs> That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, and not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Oh, <gasps> I wanted to... I'm sorry. I know things were tough on me when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliché geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Trying to say sorry. Is she gonna forgive us? <laughs> Is it gonna be awkward now? way home. <laughs> Broken. Oh, man, are you serial? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Step <laughs> douche. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. 
Welcome home, Max. Oh, she's being nice to us now. Okay. Step douche. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home shit home. Is this echoing, by the way? Don't want it to echo. Oh my god, this big booby is like right there. She likes she's my room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. It's got an Illuminati symbol. It won't play without any power. Oh. oh. She's got a nice room. I love those rooms with the dip down bit. Look. Oh, so cool. Houston, we have the power. But we need to find a disc to play. Look at that. Aww. Chloe and her dad were so close. Aww. Aww little kitty. Where's the... The discs? Um... Houston, we have the power, but we need to find a disc to play. Oh, Look at the pictures. Chloe and her dad were so close. Um, Chloe totally changed her style. I barely recognized her. Bloody CDs. So it was Chloe who printed all those flyers. I think this junk swallowed her discs. Um, fuck me. What a fucking Dump. <laughs> Dude, you broke my glass snow dough. Thanks. Draw. We had such a blast drawing these together. <laughs> She's a killer. She's a killer, yeah, baby. Where? Oh, look, it's height chart. Nothing but junk in this suitcase. Oh, God. That looks gross. Where are her CDs? Oh, there they are. <laughs> they were there all along, okay. Did they ever get why... What exactly happened to Chloe's real father? Yeah, oh... 
She, he died hey, in give a me that. car Sorry. accident. I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she was a good friend. Putting it mildly. He, he, he died in a car accident. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I'm sorry. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. <clears throat> right, I'm just moving stuff about. Uh... What about your mom? What did Joyce think about all this? She couldn't wait to get rehitched. Step Dick is one reason I wanted to bail. <laughs> Step Dick. Now, when did Step Rachel Dick, actually Step disappear? Dish. Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Did she leave? Hmm. What about her parents? Are they looking for her? They're in denial. Max, I know she's missing. I assume you know more than that. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Okay, Matt. Oh, okay. I was gonna call her Max. <laughs> oh, bless her. She's sad. She lost her girlfriend. Hey, girlfriend. Smokes like horrible cannabis. Oh, it's no good for you. Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Her be. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, shit. Oh. Dang, oh what? I don't know what that means. T T Y L. Uh, did Ra does Rachel's disappearance have something to do with brother? Yes, I'm not gonna say a lot um anything else. Um, T T Y L. What does that mean? Thanks again, Mac. Um, see, I'm like, I'm not with the hip. Well, I mean, this is 2015 actually. So, <laughs> thanks again, Max, for helping me. Uh, no problem. That guy is an asshole. Oh, I've got another one. Victoria. By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Okay. Don't worry. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. What's Joy not about? I'll take 
Alex is home yet. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Nothing. This is so lame. Beef, oh. Files. I want to look for files. I need some. These are way too big. I need tiny tools for that camera. There's a telly. Oh. What the? Chloe's <gasps> stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For real? Oh. This serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? You've got cameras everywhere. Oh my god. I'll turn Close it. Close. We don't want him to think we're snooping too much. Gun rack. Oh my god. Oh god, they've got freaking shotguns in there. Look. Okay, I'm now. Shotguns. Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. Not shitting you. Not shitting you, Max. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He Max wants to put surveillance us. cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? Uh, that show that goes to show how much you remember Nook <laughs> and Cranny of this game, especially on t some bit. Yeah, like I'll, there's, I bet they'll bound. There's bound to be some that I forget. Some Chloe's forget. stepfather oh, is this look. asshole from Blackwell. You've. Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. Oh, he's, he was in the army. I remember that. Okay. Uh, I think... I think... Oh my god. Is he organising a bunker or something? Like, for the apocalypse? He likes hunting. See, I would love to go clay pigeon shooting. I would never hunt anything. I would never shoot anything that's live. No, that's a bit. It's just. I wouldn't do that ever. But. Ooh, precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. Okay. Uh oh, God. Uh, what the washing machine turn on ah That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. <laughs> oh. Man, I should have done that before they fell. Alright, let's rewind. Rewind, yeah. Okay. Push. What's up? From Mystic Queen to you, and now your replay on. YouTube. Hello, Peewee slash body count. How you doing? How's it going? How's your Wednesday going? Happy hump day. We're halfway 
to the weekend. Okay, Jenna, sorry for leaving, but I have to go take care of some business and all. Oh, bless you. Well, okay. No, that's fine. Thanks for coming in and, you know, chatting with me. I appreciate it. Yes, you have yeah. mad, mad skills, skills, Max. Yeah. We got mad skills. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Okay. Okay, let's go upstairs then. Let's go upstairs. Let's go upstairs. What is that there? We're going upstairs. Going to see Chloe. Chloe. <clears throat> you found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. Okie dokie. What's up? <coughs> so? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah. I just took them today. Let me see. Wait. Oh, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. Oh. I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, you are a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared, too. I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Absolutely. Nathan Prescott had a fucking gun on you. Gutless prick. That was scary. Who did you tell? The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Oh, Besties. We're besties. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's Aww. so cool you remembered my birthday. But I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we get that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that phony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> This day couldn't get any stranger. This song fucking rules. 
can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yes, break it down, Max. <laughs> Such an awkward dance. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh. <gasps> Oh, no fucking, fucking way. way. You need to oh, hide oh, now. Yeah. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Fuck. What's going on? Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide. I don't know where to hide. Chloe, I'm coming. You Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Oh, don't no. Get smart. Just fuck, fuck, let fuck. me in now. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm not a kid anymore. I can't hide under the bed. Where else? the fuck can I hide? There's nowhere to hide. I'm giving you exactly three seconds to open the door. One, two, three. Shit. What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking. She's not a stranger. This is my friend. Great. Another one of your friends. No. <laughs> One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. It's not my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? Uh, yeah. My pot. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. Three seconds to open the door. One, two, three. Shit. What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking. She's not a stranger. This is my friend. Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's oh, an order. Oh god, we have it's to not say my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? That's not. Why did she put blame on me? No way, that's not mine. Oh, of course not. I'm sure oh. Chloe gets all the best shit, right? I'm sure she gave you good friend rates. Why don't you get off my crack? Stop taking your war rage out on high school girls. You haven't seen rage, you little- Fuck you, pig! <gasps> Ooh. I- Listen. You asked for that. You know exactly what you're doing. I can already tell from today that you're trouble, Max. I hope this doesn't affect your status at Blackwell. Don't ever come back here. Listen, dipshit, if you ever lay a hand on me again, I'll have your ass in jail. 
Then you can guard yourself all night. You're the ones who'll end up in jail. Oh, you only think you're tough and clever. This too shall pass. And clean this pigsty up. I'm sorry, Chloe. I didn't know what to do. Whatever. Everybody bails on me. Even my best friend Max, don't you? You can say that I'm so done with everybody in this town. I wish I hadn't even she seen you. She was gonna blame us. She was blaming care. us. Get me out of here. So, how does that not make sense? Don't feel guilty, Max. Okay, she shouldn't have. David done was it. such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? One second! My bra is stuck! I'm not screwing around, soldier! Chloe, open this door! <laughs> soldier, Chloe! She's not a soldier! I'm giving you exactly three seconds to open the door! One, two, three... Shit! What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here! Stop freaking! She's not a stranger! This is my friend! Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait! Is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. It's not my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? No way. It's not mine. Oh, of course not. I'm sure Chloe gets all the best shit, right? I'm sure she gave you good friend rage. Why don't you get off my crack? Stop taking your war rage out on high school girls. You haven't seen rage, you little... Fuck you, pig! I... Listen, you asked for that. You know exactly what you're doing. I can already tell from today that you're trouble, Max. I hope this doesn't... Exactly three seconds to open the door. One, two, three. Shit. What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking. She's not a stranger. This is my friend. Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth, that's an order. It's not my pot, it's from Max. Is this true? No way. It's not mine. Oh, of course not. I'm sure Chloe gets all the best shit, right? I'm sure she gave you good friend rage. Why don't you get off my crack? Stop taking your war rage out on high school girls. You haven't seen rage, you little- Fuck you, pig! Why? Oh, shit. Where's Chloe gone? Uh... 
Um, uh, I could change this so I don't hurt Chloe. What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking! She's not a stranger! This is my friend! Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do not believe in gun control? Wait! Is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. It's not my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? Uh, yeah. My pot. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Okay. Lighthouse. So pretty. That view as well. I just took a picture. <laughs> it's so pretty. It's a deer. Oh! Isn't this awesome sauce? Totally reminds me of when we were kids. Oh, I've always Come wanted on, to Rocco. see a deer Hold on. in the woods. I've never seen one before. I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa. That was your nightmare. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. <gasps> oh, Lord. Um. I got you. Yeah. I got a trophy. White Knight Warren here. I know you were worried about me. I owe you. Thanks for today. I'll call you back later, okay? I swear. No problem. And you still have to tell me a big secret. Equals 
K-E-K. Earth is so lucky, they can always escape. No one. How long has that been here? Oh, look how gorgeous. I'm going to take a picture. That is. You sure, you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. Um, My pleasure. Feels nice out here after all that drama. You really took one for Team Chloe. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. Um... He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? <laughs> Rambo. What files? David stashes his secret X files in there. I saw them once, but he secures them now. He kind of creeps me out. I bet the truth is out there in his files. Most likely, but it's good you didn't find his files. He would go ballistic. He's a total surveillance fetish. Where are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it. He's so hella fucking paranoid. I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's secret? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put something in my beer. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. Oh, I mean, I do. Then I what? Right. I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Oh. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Oh, good thing you notified the principal. I feel safer already. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Aww. If this is Destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. 
I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Rewind, you can move ahead of time. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zone. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But I, right? Listen to me, how do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. 
Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. Oh, snowing. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Oh, oh my lord. Trophy Chrysalis. Oh. All right. Chrysalis. You reported Nathan, 65% chose that as well. Um, you comforted Victoria, 66% did that as well. Um, you intervened to help out Kate, 82% did that as well. I'm a bit angry, uh, annoyed at myself that I didn't do that the first time because I don't know why, why, but I thought, oh, maybe taking a picture would be evidence, but, you know. Okay, I'm back. I got, I had to go to the store. All right. Um, well, we're near the end now. Well, we are at the end <laughs> of the first episode. Um, I may come on on Friday and start the next, the second episode. You took the blame for Chloe, 32%. You stayed hidden. I, I tried to hide. I tried. Um... You didn't let Daniel draw your portrait. Oh. You didn't sign Miss Grant's petition. Oh no. Oh, I didn't look around, did I really? Don't know. I think I was distracted. <laughs> you helped Alyssa. Oh, that's good then. You er erased the insults on Kate's slate. Uh, oh, that's good. At least I did that. You watered your plants. Uh, you touched Donna's. You didn't touch Donna's preg pregnancy test. 
uh, Urea or no um, you didn't touch Victoria's photos you didn't write on a dirty RV <laughs> 80% uh, you let the bird die oh no oh I didn't mean to do that how did I miss that oh no I feel bad you didn't break Chloe's snow globe you didn't leave the evident any evidence 77 you didn't read David's files I'm going to probably start this on Friday. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. What happened again? Um, I really enjoyed hanging out with you. Um, okay, at 8, yeah, around 8 o'clock. I should be on again on Friday. Um, well... Max had a premonition of the storm, the tornado again, uh, and at the end of that, of this episode gone, she had to explain to Chloe, you know, and it ended there. Um, yeah, so in this one, I just think she'll, we will, we would have told her our powers Max's powers and she, be, Chloe being Chloe wanted to test the water wants to test the waters so she'll make us go through lots of <laughs> lots of obstacle course an obstacle course to prove that we have this ability um, from what I remember in the junkyard so I think we're headed there next uh, you have yourself a great night and I'll see you on Friday okay cool if anything changes by the way if I can't if I'm not if it turns out I don't come back on Friday I will um, post it on the community page uh, and I you know, say when I will be on but as of now I'm going to keep it as Friday but in the me but if it does change by any chance I will post it in the community thing okay so before the time so I'll leave it there and thanks for hanging out with me oh no I have you Okay, cool. Awesome. Um, well, I ha thanks for hanging out with me. Uh, I've really enjoyed playing this game again on YouTube this time. Second playthrough. Um, yeah, one of, one of my favourite games, I should think. It, yeah, it is. Not think. It is. Um, it's just a beautiful beautiful artwork beautiful story you're welcome oh bless you you really are lovely very kind and enjoy your company and i will leave it there when you're on twitch again um Uh, possibly tomorrow possibly tomorrow um, I'm not really put anything set in stone this week I've just sort of sort of gone gone with it I had a, quite a busy week this week so far so yeah but um, definitely this weekend I will be taking 
the weekend off of streaming and just chilling out you know so because I, I was streaming on the weekend last weekend because I was trying to get Resident Evil finished so so I could move on to the next playthrough okay cool oh bless you thank you for understanding um but I will let you know if anything changes okay I'll head off and have a good rest of your day look after yourselves and yeah I'll see you soon for the next playthrough bye bye